Hi, welcome back to Valley News Live. We're taking a look here in Fargo where things are fairly calm. We have clear skies and just a bit of a breeze blowing that uh, steam off to the wayside. Now, that temperature right at zero degrees, we have calm winds, which means we have no wind chill either. So three zeros up there for temperature, wind chill, and that temperature across the river in Moorhead. But those clear skies are for everyone. We saw some clouds throughout much of the afternoon, but right now things are very clear. So let's take a look down at that blizzard in Southern California. We even see some snow moving into the Las Vegas area. So quite the wild system there, but back to home. We're going to look at those winds now. Pretty calm here as well, about five to 15 miles an hour for most of us and many places even winds below that speed. So things are very calm right now. Temperatures already pretty chilly in those clear skies, plus those calm winds are going to result in some falling temps overnight. Our warmest air still off to Lakes Country as well as in northern South Dakota. Those wind chills not all that bad except for folks up in the north where there's plenty of temperatures, or sorry, wind chill temperatures uh, below 20 degrees below zero. And Langdon there almost at 30 below. But as we move through the rest of the night, we're going to see a little bit more of that cloud cover start to build as we move closer to midnight. Here we are just a little bit after midnight. And temperatures, though, are already chilly. And as we work our way toward morning, we're going to see those temperatures fall even more. Here we are almost at 3 o'clock. We're going to see some fog start to form and push its way up north along the I-94 corridor by around sunrise. And we're going to start to see a little bit of a south breeze work its way in. And that south breeze is going to help us warm up up quite a bit tomorrow. Now by lunchtime, we'll see that fog push out to the west and get out of our hair. Thanks to that south breeze, that's what's going to move that fog right along. It's going to bring plenty of warmer temperatures by lunchtime already at 20 degrees for much of the area. A little colder for folks up to the northwest, but most of the area is sitting right around 20 degrees. And we're going to see some cloud cover move in during the afternoon. And those winds could intensify a little bit where you see these yellow arrows. That's 35 or so miles per hour for that wind. So we could see some pretty gusty winds, but that south wind brings plenty of warm temperatures back to the area. Most of us sitting at around 20 degrees by the time that sun sets and we're starting heading off to bed. But there's those flakes, just some light flurries moving into the area by the evening and some light mixed precip for folks down in Lakes Country. Now, tomorrow morning, things are chilly. Clear skies for most of us, some clouds building out west, and by the afternoon, though, big time warm up 20s for most of the area. And this next seven days, there are a couple hiccups Monday into Tuesday morning, and then Wednesday morning, there are some couple of chances for some snow, but that's really it and a bit of a roller coaster in temperatures. You recommend that we have a paper bag just in case for the hiccups that Mother Nature gives yes, us? It'll, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah, not, right away. <laughs> things aren't looking though too bad, though. No, honestly, not at all. Yeah. Jim, thank you so much. Well, later on in Valley News Live,